Hello, my friend. Okay, buckle up for a wild ride through the land of celebrities who have aged like milk in the sun. These once glamorous stars now look like they could be cast in a zombie movie. Whether it's the result of wild party days or some questionable plastic surgery, one thing's for sure, they don't look like themselves anymore. Let's go. Sylvester James Jocera Jessica Parker skyrocketed to fame with her portrayal of the iconic Carrie Bradshaw in Sex and the City. But before strutting her stuff in Manolo Blahniks, Parker was already a seasoned Broadway star, best known for belting out tunes as the unforgettable Annie. Transitioning from child stardom to adult roles, she dazzled audiences in films like Footloose and The Stepford Wives, alongside her bewitching turn in Hocus Focus. When Sex and the City hit screens in 98, Parker portrayed the youthful exuberance of a fledgling actress. But as the years rolled on, critics took aim at her seemingly age-defying appearance. With a physique that rivals a sapling and laughing lines that tell tales of life's ups and downs, Parker's personal struggles, including rumors of marital woes with hubby Matthew Broderick, have only added fuel to the gossip mill. Dubbed by Maxim as the world's least attractive lady, Parker embraces both the perks and pitfalls of her public persona with trademark wit and grace. After all, in a city as vibrant and fast-paced as New York, a little scandal only adds to the allure. If you want to explore the journey with me, please leave number one and watch this video until the end. Interesting things are waiting for you in the video. Corey Feldman, the quintessential heartthrob of 80s cinema, whose roles in Stand By Me, The Goonies, and The Lost Boys left an indelible mark on a generation. With his boyish charm and striking good looks, Corey had legions of adoring fans, especially during his on-screen bromance with fellow teen idol Corey Haim. But fast forward to today, and the sight of Corey might leave those nostalgic fans in disbelief. Let's just say, he hasn't exactly aged like a fine wine. In fact, he's undergone quite the transformation since his Hollywood heyday, and not necessarily for the better. His current appearance tells the tale of a tumultuous journey through the highs and lows of fame, leaving him looking more wary and weathered than we remember. Yet amidst the wrinkles and weariness, Corey has found a new purpose, shining a spotlight on the dark underbelly of the entertainment industry. His tireless advocacy against child sexual abuse has become his calling card, even if it's taken a toll on his once boyishly handsome appearance. But hey, who needs good looks when you've got a voice that's changing the world? Keep on shining, Corey. What's better than starting the day with a delicious cup of tea and watching this fascinating video together? Donatella Versace, the force behind the Versace Empire, embarked on a quest against aging but it seems she took a detour through the uncanny valley. From co-founding Versus with her brother Giovanni to reigning as VP of the Versace Group, her journey has been a roller coaster ride through the world of fashion. As Versace's influence soared, Donatella's face seemed frozen in time thanks to the magic of plastic surgery. But alas, instead of turning back the clock, it's like her face got stuck in a glitchy rewind loop. She went from a timeless beauty to a walking avant-garde art piece leaving us wondering if her surgeon moonlights as a surrealist painter. Donatella's transformation is a cautionary tale. Sometimes, the pursuit of eternal youth leads us down a runway of questionable choices. But hey, at least she's keeping us entertained with her bold approach to aging disgracefully. Janet Jackson, the legendary songstress and dance diva, has been through more transformations than a chameleon at a disco party. Back in the 80s, she was the epitome of glamour and groove, rocking the charts with her infectious beats and killer moves. But fast forward to today, and Janet's appearance has seen more ups and downs than a yo-yo on a roller coaster. Despite her ever-changing looks, one thing remains constant, her undeniable star power. It's like she's upgraded from pop princess to queen of reinvention. With her bank account as vast as her vocal range, Janet's got more money than she knows what to do with. She's been living the high life in Saudi Arabia with her wealthy hubby, soaking up the sun and counting her billions like they're going out of style. 
But hey, with great wealth comes great waistlines, and Janet's weight fluctuations have been more unpredictable than the stock market on a Monday morning. But through it all, Janet's still the same fierce force to be reckoned with. She may have traded in her leotards for loungewear, but she's still slaying the game like nobody's business. So here's to Janet Jackson, the queen of transformation, the empress of evolution, and the ultimate comeback kid of the music world. Ah, the tale of Jennifer Grey and the case of the vanishing nose. It's like a mystery novel, but with more Botox and less Sherlock Holmes. Back in 87, she was the darling of dirty dancing, with her iconic nose and bouncy curls stealing the show. But then she decided to take a little trip to the plastic surgeon's office, and boy, did things go downhill from there. Jennifer thought a tiny nose tweak would keep Father Tom at bay, but oh, how wrong she was. After the surgery, even the paparazzi were left scratching their heads, wondering who this new nose was less wonderful. Turns out, Jennifer's quest for eternal toppings. Remember his epic home alone days? Then boom! He's vanishing from the limelight, demanding millions and illegal emancipation from his own parents. Fast forward to 2012 and what's the deal? 
Culkin's morphed from adorable kid to the epitome of hipster renaissance. Sunken cheekbones, disheveled cheeks seriously? Did someone say homeless hot coocher? But hold the pepperoni. Enter the pizza underground, a band cheesier than their name. And just when you think it can't get weirder, he's back on screen with an able to talk. Amidst the musical mayhem and quirky TV shenanigans, Macaulay's rediscovered his groove. Sure, time's left its mark, but hey, who says growing up means losing your zest for life and your love for pizza? Fans adore Rod Stewart for his music and charming persona. With former flames like Bond Girl, Britt Eklund, and supermodel Rachel Hunter, Stewart's love for blondes is as legendary as his tunes. But when it comes to commitment, he's a bit unconventional eight kids, five moms, and in a penchant for gifting houses rather than saying I do again. Talk about a modern family dynamic. Thyroid cancer? Been there. Conquered that. In 2003, Stewart faced a major setback but bounced back with his signature resilience. Relearning to sing? No problem for this rock legend. From struggling with Maggie Mae to hitting those high notes again, Stewart's determination knows no bounds. And let's not forget his prostate cancer battle in 2017. Did it slow him down? Not a chance. Stewart's still rocking the stage and laying down tracks like a boss. Despite the passing years, one thing's for sure, Rod Stewart's music may age, but his spirit stays forever young. Pamela Anderson, the epitome of the blonde bombshell, skyrocketed to fame in the 90s E's at Playboy magazine's iconic Playmate of the Month. With more Playboy covers than we can count, she's the ultimate pinup girl. Who could forget her iconic red bikini as C? J. Parker on Baywatch? It practically screamed Hollywood starlet. But let's talk turkey. Pam's not immune to father time. At 53, those wrinkles are creeping in, a testament to a life lived on the edge of fame. Yet, she's still rocking that bleach blonde hair and smoldering eye makeup like it's nobody's business. Now, about that Cannes Film Festival appearance in 2017, total jaw-dropper. Rumors flew faster than a Baywatch lifeguard about her secret to eternal youth. Dr. Marino Giafoli even chimed in, recommending a little nip here and tuck there. But hey, let's not get it twisted, Pamela's still got that undeniable confidence. Her journey through Hollywood's ever-changing standards proves one thing, whether it's natural aging or a little help from the doc. Pam's all about seizing the moment, yet even she can't escape the clutches of time forever. When it comes to hip-hop, Lil' Kim is the OG trendsetter. Back when Megan Thee Stallion and Nicki Minaj were just a twinkle in the music scene's eye, she was already making waves. Even a stint in the slammer in 2000 couldn't dim her shine. But let's talk turkey. Lil Kim's beauty evolution has got tongues wagging. Around 99, she started switching it up, blonde wigs, blue contacts, you name it. Then came the plastic fantastic journey, a nip here, a tuck there, and suddenly, her face was playing musical chairs. Fast forward to 2010, and you could play spot the difference, thinner nose, plumper lips, and a skin tone that looked like it belonged on another planet. And don't even get me started on those Insta selfies from 2016, she was practically unrecognizable. But beyond the cosmetic chaos lies a deeper story. Lil' Kim's quest for beauty perfection sheds light on society's messed up standards. Her candid talks about self-esteem and toxic relationships hit home for many. Sadly, all those nip and tucks couldn't stop father time from knocking on her door. Despite her best efforts, Lil' Kim's aging like fine wine bold, unapologetic, and impossible to ignore. Mickey Rourke was the epitome of Hollywood charm and rugged good looks. Then came the plot twist. He swapped the red carpet for the boxing ring, trading punches instead of lines. It was a knockout move, but not in the way you'd expect. 
Rourke's boxing stint left him looking less leading man and more like he'd gone a few rounds with Tyson. Broken noses, snapped cheekbones, his face bore the scars of battle. Desperate to preserve his on-screen appeal, he turned to the surgeon's scalpel. But as luck would have it, the results weren't quite Oscar-worthy. At first, Rourke played coy, denying any nip-and-tuck action. But in a dramatic turn of events, he came clean, admitting to a botched surgery saga. Cue the regret, and the blame game turns out, he'd picked the wrong doc. In a last-ditch effort to reclaim his Hollywood throne, Rourke went under the knife again, this time for a hair transplant. But the plot thickened when rumors surfaced about his Botox obsession, could his face still move? Cosmetic surgeon drama ensued, leaving us wondering, is trying to fight Father Time worth the battle scars? Meg Ryan, the darling of romantic comedies, enchanted audiences with her doe-eyed charm in the mid 1980s Yet, at the height of her fame, she chose to step out of the limelight, citing burnout and loneliness. Since then, Ryan has kept a low profile, making sporadic appearances. However, her reappearance at the 2016 Tony Awards sparked chatter. With a markedly altered appearance, her signature blonde locks and tightened complexion Ryan left many questioning if she had undergone cosmetic enhancements. Similar speculation arose after her unconventional appearance at Paris Fashion Week in 2019. While Ryan has denied undergoing plastic surgery and claimed to embrace aging, experts suggest otherwise. From lip fillers to facelifts, these procedures aim to defy time. Yet, despite these efforts, Ryan's appearance suggests otherwise. In fact, some argue she looks worse post-surgery. In the end, Meg Ryan's journey serves as a reminder that no amount of cosmetic tinkering can truly halt the march of time. Perhaps, like many of us, she's learning to embrace the beauty of aging gracefully, quirks and all. Nick Nolte, once hailed as the suburban housewife's heartthrob with his golden boy charm and feathered bangs, has undergone a surprising transformation. Today, he sports a weathered and rough appearance, attributed to his tumultuous past involving drugs and two notorious mugshots. It's hard to believe that Nolte began his career as a model, given his current rugged look. In his heyday, he was the epitome of charm, captivating suburban housewives with his golden boy allure and stylish hair. However, the toll of a hard-lived life, coupled with substance abuse and legal troubles, has left him looking far older than his years. Despite his weathered exterior, Nolte's rough demeanor and disheveled appearance have found a niche in Hollywood. He excels in roles portraying inebriated sailors and cantankerous old characters, leveraging his lived-in look to bring authenticity to the screen. Guitar legend Keith Richards appears far older than his actual age, resembling more of a 90-year-old grandpa than a 70-year-old man. It's a startling sight that serves as a cautionary tale against the pitfalls of alcohol and tobacco indulgence. Richards' weathered visage is a stark reminder of the toll that years of substance abuse can take. Indeed, Richards' tumultuous past, marred by extensive drug use and numerous brushes with the law, has left an indelible mark on his health and appearance. His once youthful features now bear the unmistakable signs of a life lived on the edge. Moreover, Richard's outdated views on modern music, particularly his aversion to rap and hip-hop, further underscore his age. While he may be a musical genius in his own right, his reluctance to embrace evolving genres reveals a disconnect with contemporary trends. Despite his legendary status, Keith Richards serves as a cautionary tale about the perils of excess and the inevitable consequences of a life lived in the fast lane. Don't forget to drink a cup of tea to quench your thirst and comment number one to let me know that you are still watching this video. In the glitzy era of the 1970s and 1980s, 
Goldie Hawn dazzled her way into Hollywood, earning acclaim with two Oscar nominations. Her daughter, the talented Kate Hudson, has since kept her legacy alive in the public eye. Yet, even for the luminous Goldie, aging remains an inevitable reality, creeping up with each passing year. Despite her reputation as the effervescent and enchanting blonde of yesteryear, Goldie hasn't shied away from acknowledging her fear of aging. However, her approach to maintaining her timeless beauty is refreshingly down-to-earth, with a simple yet diligent skincare routine. From gentle face washes to soothing massages and hydrating creams, Goldie's regimen exudes simplicity and efficacy. While she swears by natural remedies like coconut oil and lemon-based exfoliants, whispers of cosmetic enhancements linger. Speculation abounds, with some suggesting the possibility of facelifts or fillers. Yet, despite her meticulous efforts, the relentless march of time inevitably leaves its mark. Frankie Mooney's shot to stardom as the lovable Malcolm and Malcolm in the middle, but his Hollywood journey pretty much ended there. With his infectious smile and mesmerizing blue eyes, 
Muniz stole hearts and even snagged an Emmy as a child star. However, he's forever tied to the iconic role, which has been a double-edged sword. Struggling to shake off the Malcolm label, Muniz eventually bid farewell to Tinseltown. Instead, he traded scripts for motorcycles and drumsticks, carving out a new path for himself. But one thing that's hard to ignore is how drastically his appearance has changed. Aging doesn't seem to agree with him, and some of his wild hairstyle experiments might have missed the mark. Beyond the surface, Muniz has been grappling with serious health setbacks. Memory loss, stemming from a series of concussions and seizures, has clouded his recollections of his time on set. Despite these challenges, Muniz soldiers on, charting a course away from the glare of Hollywood's spotlight. Lawrence Turode, famously known as Mr. T, left an undeniable mark on the 1980s film industry. However, when diagnosed with cutaneous T-cell lymphoma, his journey took an unexpected turn. True to his character, Mr. T faced the situation with his trademark wit, even joking about the illness being named after him during interviews. In the A-Team movie, he brought more than just his iconic name, he added a human touch to the narrative. In 2005, Hurricane Katrina brought about a profound shift in Mr. T's life. Witnessing the devastation, he felt compelled to assist in the cleanup efforts. Out of respect for the victims who lost everything, he decided to shed his famous gold jewelry. This gesture reflected his empathy and understanding of their plight. Though he may have parted with his signature gold, Mr. T's influence and unique persona continue to resonate with his dedicated fan base. However, the toll of aging, likely exacerbated by his health battles, is evident. Henry Thomas, etched into our memories from four decades past, soared to stardom with his iconic portrayal in it. T, the extraterrestrial at a tender age of 10, temporarily escaping the limelight, he sought the solace of a normal childhood, only to be drawn back by his unwavering passion for the craft. In his later years, Thomas has woven a tapestry of roles across diverse genres, gracing screens in Dear John, Gangs of New York, Doctor Sleep, and the spine-chilling The Haunting of Bly Manor on Netflix. Yet, despite his multifaceted career, the passage of time has left its mark on him. At 50, he bears little resemblance to the wide-eyed child actor of E. T. Wrinkles and tired eyes tell the tale of Mark Hamill's swift journey from the youthful Luke Skywalker of the original Star Wars trilogy to an older, wiser version in the new trilogy. Despite the visible signs of aging, Hamill seamlessly embraced the transition, bringing depth to his iconic character in The Force Awakens, The Last Jedi, and The Rise of Skywalker, skillfully incorporating the effects of time into his portrayal. Even within the vast reaches of a distant galaxy, the relentless march of time is undeniable. George Lucas's foresight in crafting a character like Luke Skywalker resonates profoundly, offering audiences of all ages a connection to the timeless themes of growth, transformation, and the inevitability of change. Brigitte Bardot, a true Renaissance woman, mesmerized audiences with her beauty and talent across various fields. As a singer, actress, and model, she effortlessly captivated hearts during the 1950s and 1960s, establishing herself as a quintessential sex symbol. Her illustrious career included starring roles in 16 acclaimed comedies and appearances in 47 other films. Bardot's artistic prowess extended to music, where she composed over 60 songs showcasing her diverse talents. However, the passage of time has inevitably taken its toll, and at 81 years old, Bardot's once iconic image has faded. 
the youthful radiance that defined her has given way to the marks of aging, perhaps influenced by a colorful past. While Bardot may claim contentment, her appearance suggests a life filled with the effects of a wild party lifestyle. The video ends here. Remember, there are still many other interesting and engaging videos in my playlist. Before you leave, please leave a comment number one if you found the video interesting, or number two if not. It's that simple, isn't it? Thank you!